Hey yo, what up, Bodega Podcast? You already know who it is. It's one half of the sexiest Puerto Rican studs on this planet, Ortiz, baby. And shout out to all the Bodega Podcast listeners. Ow. Yo, this is the Lucha Thug, the one man Lucha gang, El Rey Gordo himself, the King Fat Boy Papa Wesco, and y'all rocking with the Urban Wrestling Network. It's your boy, the Young Goat, one half of Injustice, Hot Fire Minery, and you're listening to Urban Wrestling Network. Okay. This is Joseph Samael from Contra Unit, and you're watching the Urban Wrestling Network. What's good? It's Tristan Ty, a.k.a. Kiro Kwan. You're watching Urban Wrestling Network. Hail Contra! What's up? It's Judge in the building. And make sure you guys check out Urban Wrestling Network. The boys gonna be on there chopping it up. You already know, Street Fighter. Oh, it is, man. It's like Boogie, South Philly. What up? Catch me in the Urban Wrestling Network real soon. Be on the lookout for that podcast, bro. Yes. MLW all that. And then we all that. I'm everywhere. Fuck out of here. <laughs> hey, you guys. This is Christy James, and you're listening to the Urban Wrestling Network. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Jeff Cavier, and you are listening to the Urban Wrestling Network. Hey, guys, this is Carla Delani Perez, a.k.a. Petula, a.k.a. ¿Qué tal amigos de Urban Wrestling Podcast? Aquí está el mosquetero del aire solamente para decirles que sigan a mis amigos de Wrestling Podcast eh, toda la mejor información, un saludo y un abrazo del mosquetero, la mejor lucha está con el Stretch Style, así es que cuídense y vean este buen podcast Hip Hop and all types of shit, we gonna get this motherfucker in Ladies and gentlemen, what's really good? It's the OG Boricua Don Dada, a.k.a. Chef. I'm here with none other than my brother, Ivalonce. Ivalonce, how are you? What's up, baby pop? I'm here. I just came back from Philly. I saw the man right there doing his spins. After the homies won, you know, we can't say they did anything, but we already know. 5151, those bells, thanks to the homie right here. Mr. Smokes right there. Right there, baby. That's it, man. That's it right so, there. So, party was ready. Say less, party war. You know what I mean? Come, come. Yes, sir. So, I was, listen, I did have to tell him. I was like, yo, my partner who does this is the guy who always gives the flags to y'all. So, I was like, this is this is the man that always gives y'all the flags. Um, well, yes, sir. So, Evil Lone, say, please hit him with your first question because, like I said, I'm staying away from wrestling. I know you're going to live on the wrestling. Hey man, hey, I'm in Harlem right now. I'm in Spanish Harlem right now. Let's get it, baby. Let's stand up. The east side, hey, man. The east side. Let's go. Uh, hey man, yeah. I, I I love that you're here. I saw your documentary on YouTube like two, three weeks ago. Thank you. I appreciate. And I, was, I was mad as hell because it finished, and I I was like, where the hell is the rest? I need more. Like, what happened? Like that whole hour and a half went fast. And I was like, where's the rest of it? Like, I'm like, where's the rest? That's, that can't be it. Mm. Is there more? Well, you know, death was by temptation. You know what I mean? So, hell yeah, it's a lot more, but uh, this gave me a little little dip dabber. You know what I mean? A little, a little dropper. Uh, you know? so a little dropper. A little dropper the antidote. So it's going to be different chapters, different parts here and there, or... Well, I got other people that basically want to do other things with me, so um, I'm just going to let it let it naturally progress, you know what I mean? I don't want to do too much, a little here, a little there. Um, I still have a story to tell at MOW, and um, I want to put my work in. I mean, we won the titles, but we still want to put our work in to establish ourselves as being one of the dominant tag teams of all time. That's what we're here to do, literally. You know what I'm saying? The backseat there's nobody at. Come, come, yes, sir. Come, uh, and I say immediately. <laughs> so now I'm not even gonna lie to you. Like I grew up 
and I was playing like you. I played football and basketball, so I ran point, and I played defensive back. So I was like, I know. Let me be your doctor. Let me be your doctor. <laughs> <laughs> so when you played ball, I gotta know what position because I know you're. I know you're high, so you're more like a a point guard, like a point shooting guard. But did you handle the rock, or did you love being in the paint? Because you're old school. I was a little guy who loved being in the paint myself. Well, you know, we all grew up loving uh, Mark Jackson and uh, Ross Strickland, those guys back in the days. If you were in New York, that's where it's at. You know what I mean? Say less. And uh, going to the Rucker Park, you already know. You're going to the hole. You, right. you don't really cry about fouls because you know we're going to get the N1 in it. That's where we at. Right. You notice we play against out-of-town dudes. They be crying like babies. Like, come on, in New York, we don't, we don't make that call, but you a bitch. Fuck out of here. But, uh... <laughs> Before you that's say a, anything, I, that's I like a to fact. That's a listen, fact. I love to tell people because I'm 42, so I'm from the era where point game you get thrown into a fence if it's my man or not. Like yeah. this generation, they're not built like that. They mad soft. Mm. Foul, foul, foul. Some of them. Yeah. Foul. And go at it when you watch basketball, that. But pretty much across the board, how they call the game, it's because of that, literally. You know what I mean? They're going to the three-point line, seven foot five, trying to hit three-pointers instead of going down low, dunking on them, getting that easy two. Yep. Um, easy two on a consistent basis be the uh, a lousy three at any time, you know. So um it is what it is, baby. Let's move up with the time, you know what I mean? But uh how about them cowboys? How about them cowboys? Let's go. Stop playing with me. How about them cowboys? <laughs> Come on, man. That's just no way. You're, you're, how are you a cowboy fan, man? Come on I have, now. I have, to, I have to boo you on that one, brother. Boo, uh, boo, 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 boo. I like that. You know, it, it, it's supposed to be that way. Uh, Here you go, man. Here, yellow flag right there. <laughs> 15 um, yards for faking the fuck right there on the Cowboys. Just growing up in VN a little while in North Carolina, places like that, you know, they always showed the Cowboys in Redskin games. That's all it was. Cowboys, Cowboys, Cowboys. And I just loved that star. It was just something about Tony Dorsett, Roger Starback, Tony Hill, um, Charlie Waters, and Tuta Jones. <laughs> he stops. And, um, you know, that that's where it was at. But I also respect the Giants. I mean, come on, Lawrence Taylor. That was, <laughs> wow, that was a monster on fucking wheels right there. Yeah, he was destroying motherfuckers out there, bro. Yeah. Respect, respect is due. And Joe Morris, one of the greatest running backs of all time, and he don't get no credit. Wow. He was running that ball like a fucking. What? Keebler. Like a Keebler with cleats. You know what I mean? A Keebler with cleats. Literally. If I got that out. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Jose, what you got for him, baby? Yo, Mr. Smokes, man, so how did you get, how did you get back into wrestling, man? Because you were gone for a while. We'll call it a comeback. I've been here for years. Uh, I was doing the Urban Wrestling Federation back in 2012. You know what I mean? That was paper be for a little while. You know what I mean? Um, wow. Um, I'm Catalyst Wrestling. Um... They doing phenomenal things. I'm, I'm, I'm managing the rep there. We two times um, tag team champions there. We're going for the third one. Uh, I got Jesse Brooks. I manage her. Um, wow. Marsha Stoyanovich. You know, oh. she's a champion. Yeah. You know what I mean? I manage her at Combat Sports. Um, that's an MMA jump off right there. You know what I mean? She's doing a thing there. You're busting them up. Mash them up, Masha. Mash them up. Mash them up. It's a cold road in Russia. <laughs> come, come. Cold road in Russia. Hold up, hold up. So, now I got to ask you, like I said, I'm a big hip-hop head, right? And I and I had to say, I love your music. I've said this to you before when obviously off-air type shit. But what got, you, what got you into the music? Now, I know the documentary, but for people who might not know, and I'm going to put you the link for your documentary in our profile, but what got you into the music? I'm in love with that Mary Jane. 
It makes your eyes bleed. That chocolate tie is right. Blast him, I'm it up on that now, boy. Come, come to me. Um, Boogie Number Productions. Well, I will get paid, paid, paid me right there. Don't fix rhymes and make them better. That's what got me in. Remember to let us take your skin, skin, and let us begin to mess the rhyme and rhyme and rhyme and rhyme and rhyme and rhyme and rhyme You rhyme stop, yo. You know what I mean? 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 You know what I Facts. That's all you see the walker do the block with the BDP jackets on. Yes. Love hip hop. I was like 86, 87. I was a little shorty on the block. That motivated me to be something better. And plus, I already see it over the mountaintop because I lived in Virginia. You know what I mean? Um, you know, upstairs, downstairs, back to our front yard, you know, that that southern life. So I, I knew what it was about and I wanted to get back to that. But I stayed in New York because I love it. I love it right now. There's just something about it, baby. I'm not even going to lie. I was loving the documentary, right? And you was going in, and then you said, the bridge is over, and I was like, oh, hell no. Nah. Like, being a Queens guy, I was like, oh, here we go. Like, the documentary was fire until you dropped it, even though it's one of the hottest songs always. You know what I mean? Like, it's a serious track. But as a Queens native guy, I... I, I, I plan, bro. I mean, uh, when it came down... I mean, with the battle that was going on, Queens, Queenbridge, South Bronx, it was just hip hop. New York was on fire. That's the bottom line. New York was on fire. That's the only thing I'm looking at, brother. <laughs> now, how did you get mixed in with LAX 5150, man? A blessing in the skies, yo. I mean, basically, um, this, um, Tune in, made that phone call. Court Barrow made it happen. Uh, he put a signature behind it. They wanted me to be in the group. Um, you know, I managed, um, you know, um, Rocky and Ricky back in the days for the Tag Team Champions, uh, all age back in 2004. Uh, managed Homicide to the World Championship uh, back in 2006, regular honor. And, you know, as I say, we on the path to the goal. So they wanted to add me to the team and um the rest is history. It's a good luck charm, baby. Yeah, I, I remember that I remember that Vulture squad from back in the days. Blessings to Conan because he stuck to his guns. He told me back in the ring all a long time ago, once the position opened up for you, I got you, smoke, but worry about it. And um said on the sideline, doing my thing, um, stay relevant. And once he made that phone call, I was eligible and ready to go off the bench like a real oil machine. Let's go. Let's yeah, get it. That, I remember that. I remember that. I remember that. I, I remember that Vulture squad, which, which back in the days you had there at Ring of Honor. Mm hmm. The cool crew there for a while. This is Vulture. Chocolate Vulture. You know what I mean? Let's get it. Squad. Wow. And you were like, wow, wow, over the fly. Entertainment at its best. That's what sports entertainment is. Some people forget about that. You know, um, yeah. I was in loving every bit of it. You know what I mean? So now the only wrestling question I'm gonna ask because yeah, whatever. I, well, no, I'm I'm just saying because my son is a huge LAX fan. He's been an LAX fan since Impact. Loves fifty one fifty. He's fourteen. He thinks you guys are slightly ugly, ugly. Oh, he's vicious, huh? Like that Washington Heights, left hook. You know what I mean? Straight hook. Blah, blah. <laughs> I see that El Jefe and I, you guys are the only ones who, when you've gotten in a ring that have matched El Jefe's like, energy and the way he's able to command a microphone, right? Now, it's weird because everybody has their, their style in, in 5150. But with you, you're like this pit bull. And you seem to always, always be going at El Jefe and running up on him. And I was like, yo, the mind games that Julius Smokes is playing with El Jefe is next level shit. Mm. I'm, I'm bringing it from the gates of hell. That fire is real hot. That's that hell fire. And I don't think he really knows about that. He played with it a little bit. But, you know, 
I was growing up in a Pentecostal church. I don't even think he had that Holy Ghost. You know what I mean? I was dropped from the heaven. <laughs> I'm the double seller. And I'm the doctor. Come, come. And we wanted those tag team championships. We got that tape worm in our stomach. And, um, you know, it's blueprints the way of getting that. Conan just says, stick to the game plan. He itched it out. It's all about Conan right now. And uh, we just filled in the blank, show. Literally. Thank you, Conan. Let's go. Are you going to get in the ring, you ring of honor? I mean, I'll be here at MLW. Oh, oh, I, you can't yeah. let him release that type of gem on him, man. Hey, man, I'm just wondering know if he's going to get in the ring. How do you want it? Who want it? You know what I mean? Come, come. And I say immediately. Hold up. The first time we see him, he allegedly hit somebody with, with something in a sock. Nah. So I've already seen Julius oh. Smoke put that smoke on somebody. Did it right. represent it? I mean, whatever record we don't see, he can't call. So I don't know what you're talking about in that situation. I, I mean, I say allegedly, allegedly, that's what people are saying. You know what I mean? But you know what? I stay in my lane. Uh, we have Slice Piggy. You know what I mean? We had uh, uh, the radioactive Poppy. Poppy. You know what I mean? Yeah, 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 baby. Yo, that's Al Pacino, 1980, right there. The <laughs> lace of him. Yo, he give the Yo, he giving a lot. Yo, he giving a, he giving a Chakitas, my Chakitas out there that rock. You know what I mean? And we don't discriminate, literally. But you know, that's what he does. He gives them that rock. Yeah. And um, I stay on my language as be the manager, bro. The hype man. That's what I do. I'm the energy god. Oh, nobody can touch your energy. I'm gonna tell you that right now. Ain't nobody, ain't nobody I've seen in the last ridiculous amount of years or maybe ever can touch your energy that's straight but facts i just do me you know i i don't try to emulate nobody else um whoever like it likes it whoever don't don't i'm there for my tag team to put them over in every which way to be in their corner giving their energy outside and inside the ring you know a lot of managers you know on the inside they do what they do i'm saying outside the ring too i bust them up you know what I mean? That's what we do. I don't care if you're a Papa Chicken, Wawa's, uh, a Bodega. We're going to transform on you. We're going to flip on you. You know what I mean? So we're about our business that way. We really, we roll that way. It's real. We don't have to fake our aggression. We really came from that. I really had fights in high school, elementary school, primary, Bronx, Brooklyn, two train, six train. You know what I mean? So that's the energy that I give. But it's, it's also, uh, it's also um, organized violence at its best. It will never jump out of that. But when you jump inside that lion's den, <laughs> you know, they have that five hour energy drinks. They should come up with you with your face on it called the, the smokes drink or something. Five hour energy, like the, the Julius Smooth, right, right there. You go right there. There you go right there. Put your face <laughs> on it and sell that. I'll I'm buy it. I'll buy a bottle. I'll I'm buy a bottle right now. Now, you know, you really don't need that. You know, like I, you, if you saw the documentary, you ought to know what this is. This is pure CAC. Uh, I'm MND. I'm um, registered New York State. I have my um, registration card, medical. And, um, let me be your doctor. So, I, now I got to ask because I, I was like, like, I drink my marijuana. Why not? Listen, I've seen Gary Payton, Sean Kemp, Killer Cam all get into the weed industry. We need a Dr. Julius. Now, it, wait, is that yours? Like, is that a signature Dr. Julius smokes? Because if it is, I'm telling you now, I want to see a label. And I'm really? not saying I might have some back pain or or, or just need to relax, but you know. <clears throat> Yo, is a homicide drinking from the fountain of youth right now, bro? It's incredible what he's doing. You know what I mean? But yeah. I'm smelling I'm smelling salt from Texas. You know, some um some Mamuya. Some some tight jeans, you know. Some boys want to jump in. 
to the uh <laughs> the lion's den. Your hands is too short to box with the Spanish kings, the Latin kings, the vicious. <sighs> Echo Latino, stand up right now. Let's go. Let's go. Come, come. Let's get it. Boric was in the motherfucking building all day, every day. That's Listen, good. I tell you, God, he's going to get me to get in trouble tonight. I'm going to go outside and move my shit up. He's going to. I told him, he, he makes fun of me. My partner, Evil Ote, makes fun of me because we did a podcast at the Radio Times. Y'all talk shit. Style. We're going to crack that whip in Texas. We know what's coming up. We know what's coming up. I told you. I you told know, you. You know that Mexico. You're going to come back with Mexico with more gold around our belt. Understand what I'm coming from? We got the Spanish boogie man. That's the purple haze. Oh my God! You better not have Bojo Rose around that boy. He took yo. He choking you out, literally. Slice boogie. He's vicious, young. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, listen, Slice. I think Slice is from my. I think Slice is from my hood. I seen him cut a promo, and he named the projects, and I was like, "Wait a minute! If that's the homie, I gotta go slice boogie heavy out here." But I'm gonna tell you, they're gonna y'all gonna come into Dallas, fuck shit up, and ain't them up. Listen, right now there's no train hotter than fucking LAX 5150. However, anybody wants to label it, this is the hottest motherfuckers in the building. Evil Ose, ask him one more question before we get up out of here. I don't want to kill his time. Yeah, we see nothing yet. We want to put our work in. We just started. Right. We to put our stamp on it. You know what I mean? This is Camaro. Jackson's anywhere that you go, you saw nine and a half. They had a step on that bag. You know what I'm talking about, right? Yes, sir. Huh? Amsterdam, stand up right now. One five seven, one five eight Broadway. You know what I mean? Come, come to me. We got that rock, boy. You stupid. You, you, yeah. Come, come. And we're all champions right now. We will be in that Puerto Rican Day Parade with that belt. Yeah. Oh, hold up. 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 How much I want that hammerstone later on? We want to go. We want to go. We want to go. I'm greedy. I would love to see you guys in the Puerto Rican Day Parade. It would be. Oh, the gold. Oh, my God. Can you imagine holding mad gold at the parade? Oh, my. I'll lose my motherfucking shit. Even though I'm saying, please, ask, ask this man one more question so we can just let him get up out of here. Enjoy hey. the rest of his night so we don't mess with his, you know what, hey. on his on his blessings right there. We, we, we You got the tag team titles. What's next, man? What other bills are we getting? Um, First of all, yo, blessings to uh, the guy, just a general, yo, that's put us in position to be 23 years later down the line to be able to say that we're going after the tag team championship for me being involved or something like this. Understand where I'm coming from? I am black a lot. I'm Jacob for the power of you. Nah. And as I said, we're on the road to the goal. We don't see nothing else. You got to level up. Seriously. We're turning it up. As I said, homicide's the next step. But right now, uh, we got the World Tag Team Championships, MOW. And we just want to establish ourselves for being the best of all times. Hamad Ali style, baby. Promote ourselves all day, every day. I don't want about to So what? I didn't see Rick Flair walking around on rock and roll with no loot bags and um, gorgeous short George shirts. I saw him walking around with this. That's the same thing I did, baby. Promotion all day. Oh, yeah. Listen, I, we've asked him a lot of questions. This man is a king. And I'm going to tell you that if you don't understand his history, I'll put him against any manager in time. And I guarantee you at the end of the day, you're like, this motherfucker, Dr. Julius Smokes, the baddest man that we've seen do this shit. He talks that shit. He's one of ours. And when I say one of ours, that urban shit that we come from, that motherfuckers don't understand that type of lingo, this is our product. This is why we love these guys. This is why we support them as heavy as we do. Because everything we understand, it sounds like this. It looks like this. This is our motherfucking champion. And I'm going to tell you that now. I can't wait to see Homicide take another belt. Yes. Put it on him. We get some more gold. I, you know what? 
I don't even want to keep talking shit. Y'all already know what the fuck it is. Urban Wrestling Network, Buddha Heads Record. If you don't know that shit, get your motherfucking shit right, because they got that fire. Ladies and gentlemen, drop some, lyrics. And drop some lyrics. Drop some lyrics. Undo Cardi, all over your body, Illuminati style. You know what I mean? Undo Cardi, the anthem. You know, it's in all stores, across the board, in every which way. You know how we do it. Um, Apple Music, Spotify, um, as I said, all platforms, bro. Across the board, we on that. Pandora. All platforms. Check that out. Check that out. Undo Kati. U N D D U K A T I. Yo, South Bronx, stand up. Ladies and gentlemen, we're out of here. Deuces. You are not built for this. EMS. Undo Kati. Taquati. Nate B2 for on the beat. Gonna get this work, man. <laughs> Black Mafia. What's pain? French bread. What's fatigue? Army clothes. Wanna stop? Fuck that. Wanna quit? Hell no. You want some more? I want some more. 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 What's pain? Fresh bread. What's fatigue? Army clothes. Wanna stop? Fuck that. Wanna quit? Hell no. You want some more? I want some more. 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 I bench press, stress, I leg lift, hate, I curl pleasure and pain. I push up on my faith. I pull up on my faith. Exercising my demons, power walk to success, the sprints of my goals, seeing I'm seeing the finish line, front and Freemasons, pacing sluggish, can't cut it. My back is seeing, fade into the distance. Lames lost in lingo and lapped in sentence. Ball is more like RuPaul is that plan in fitness. You better work, bitches. You chicken chest pigeons. Birds get hit with the hawk, so fricassee gizzards. Too hot in hell's kitchen. Sweating and mitching under pressure. My weather's better, heaven has air condition. Uplifting diction over flavor gets the word out. Booth bedroom, even biceps, full body workout. Insane as having two broken legs with black mafia giving your chair shots to the head. What's pain? Fresh bread. What's fatigue? Army clothes. Wanna stop? Fuck that. Wanna quit? Hell no. You want some more? I want some more. 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 What's pain? Fresh bread. What's fatigue? Army clothes. Wanna stop? Fuck that. Wanna quit? Hell no. You want some more? I want some more. 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 I sweat. Weakness in its liquid form I've seen a beast of a man grow from a leprechaun Throw the keys to the van, chain links in his palms Drag the thing home like a disobedient dog Ripping medium cloth and often for the two X It's win after win after win Asking who's next, two steps, one reach You end up in a choke, hold two deaths in one week Tap out a KO, wrath of a Greek god Mortally disguised, molded the mangle men Marbly motionless eyes Wait upon the bar saying bitch don't kill my vibe I'm Trying to beat a record here, you like half my size Warming up with your max, that's why he's laughing at you Holding weight without flinching, a living at the statue Grinning as his face is red, his neck is pushing veins The only way there is to bring a title to his name What's pain? Fresh bread What's fatigue? Army clothes Wanna stop? Fuck that Wanna quit? Hell no You want some more? I want some more 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 What's pain? Fresh bread What's fatigue? Army clothes Wanna stop? Fuck that Wanna quit? Hell no, you want some more? I want some more, you want some more, I want some more, you want some more, I want some more, you want some more, I want some more. It's beautiful. Tree shaking, eliminating, shook 106 in Parkinson, cherry gelatin, delicate patrons, dressed for their funeral, decked in their custom favorites. Southern hospitality, introduction of pavement, bludgeon and bloody, ashy knuckles and muddy, take fists and tables, chair shots confront me. Fuck a one, two, three, I want tap outs when I tap chins. Lash out on whoever has a title, order, grab them. Clear a the forehead, gashes beyond morbid Crash into a brick wall, that's a two-week forfeit The pinnacle of champion, I put the smack you off it Tuck that man in his coffin, shut and close it Frozen, these clothes get folded, just like clothing Tucked in Satan's dresser, that's without a rehearse Then I sport the black gear, hoodie down in my black converse Pulling up upon the church in a white hearse What's pain? Fresh bread What's fatigue? Army clothes Wanna stop? Fuck that Wanna quit? Hell no You want some more? I want some more You want some more? I want some more 
some more? You want some more? I want some more. You want some more? I want some more. What's the pain? Fresh bread. What's for tea? I'm in clothes. Wanna stop? Fuck that. Wanna quit? Hell no. You want some more? I want some more. You want some more? I want some more. You want some more? I want some more. You want some more? I want some more.